Hey, welcome back to Delirium Plus. If this is your first time here, then welcome. I'm Ghosthead. In this video, I'll be coloring the sculpt that I made in an earlier video. I'll be talking about color theory, or to be a little more exact, complementary colors. This video is part of an ongoing series where I talk about design, specifically character design, but the methods I talk about are not limited to characters. You can easily apply these methods to props, clothing, or anything else you imagine. A playlist of this series will be on the card above. If you came to my video from one of my fan sculpt videos, thank you for sticking around and looking at my other content. I will be making more fan sculpt videos in the near future. Feel free to stick around though. Let's dive into what this video is about color theory, or even more exact, complementary color. Complementary colors are when two colors are found opposite to each other on the color wheel. For example, orange and blue, or red and green. The large contrast of complementary colors can make designs really pop, especially if you use the colors at full saturation. This color scheme, having both warm and cold colors, can be difficult to balance. Usually when using a contrasting color scheme, it's important to choose which color will be the primary and which will be an accent. It's very common to reduce the saturation of colors and use softer shades. You could reduce the contrast to make design have more balance. Complementary color schemes work well to add emphasis, giving focus and more attention to a particular area in the design. With that, I'll be wrapping up the basics of complementary colors. You are more than welcome to stick around while I finish painting my sculpt. For those who just want to see the finished version, I left the time code below. Before I go, I want to tell you something. You are more than you do, more than you like, and more than you give to others. Stay lively, and see you later!
game begin.